All right. Um, yes, very good questions. I apologize having not covered this more carefully before, so that's why I'm recording this specific video. Thanks to Max for the example. So let's say you have an instance like this, where you are trying to create a knob with maybe like a convex here. Max has both of these shapes sketched already. So again, I can go to features, I can go to lofted boss base. It's asking me what profiles I want. I can select this sketch, and then I can select this sketch. I think everyone understands this from the demo. Guide curves, I can select this bottom edge. Again, I think everyone understands this. Here's where I think the challenge happens that I haven't expressly stated. Obviously, you wanna have it follow this top edge. If I try and click this individually, it treats it as one edge, it treats it as a third edge, it treats it as a fourth edge. That's not what we want it to do. So I'm gonna select all those and hit delete. This is the key feature and the whole reason I'm recording this, I want you all to know this. If you wanna do that, it's a series of edges, you wanna right click on this and click on selection manager, then select those edges. I will do, right, so now I have all these purple edges, now I click the checkbox, You'll notice it shows up as open group down here, and now it follows that. I will do this again because it's incredibly important. I apologize for having glossed over it or not having said it. So once again, if you ever want to have edges as a guide for a loft or even for a sweep, you want to use what's called selection manager. You get to it by right clicking on the first edge you want and then scrolling to selection manager. It then brings up this little box it defaults to continuous, Don't it, you can ignore these other things. And then again, you can select all the edges you want, then click the checkbox, and then it will treat it as one edge, even though it's technically three. Yeah, Max. I can't, I can't think of an instance where you want it separately. I think it's just the way it's programmed. I agree, it's kind of convoluted. There might be an easier way to bring up selection manager than right click and whatever. There could, we could also set a hotkey for it. So we cannot just click on everything and that actually... I don't think so. We can try it. That would make sense, actually. Let's try it real quick, and then I want to hand back rights. No, shift quickly doesn't work. That would make sense, though. Okay, so right-click, selection manager. You can do it with sketches, too. Cool. 